Okay, this is just another video, this one for using R to do a two-sample t-test. Here I am in an Excel file, which I have saved as a CSV file. The first column is a random variable X, maybe that's some kind of test score or something like that. And then a group, which I have, in, have two groups here, so a series of ones and twos. Again, that's saved as a CSV file. Okay, so for R, I've got my, let's see, I don't want to call that tutorial. That's not good. I'll call it data. since this is data for the two sample t-test then hit enter there we go data dot two there it is don't forget to attach Now I'm going to do so now I'm going to do by I got to click in there X is my random variable I want to get these for each group and I want to get the mean I called that group. So there are the means for both groups. I'm going to arrow up here and just change the mean to SD. There are my standard deviations. Bring that back up. Change that to length. Gives me my sample sizes. And then I'm going to do t dot test x tilde group. I think that's all I need to do for a two-tailed test. You can see it gave me a confidence interval, and then there's the t is equal to 0.53. That's the t test. The p value 0.6. So that means that uh, I'm fairly likely to get the result that I have here. The difference between means here is uh, about 0.9. You can see that the confidence interval includes zero. And so I'm going to fail to reject HO and conclude that the two means might be the same. 